Researchers at UMass Medical School now have an HIV vaccine ready to be tested. A doctor there has spent more than 30 years working on it in an effort to address the major global health threat. Our Chandler Walsh explains. Researchers at UMass Medical School are working on an HIV vaccine. The solution for preventing HIV and AIDS could one day come from Worcester. It can be useful for any of us if you are under any risk to be infected. The vaccine is now in the beginning stages of testing, making sure it's safe. UMass's Sean Liu has been working on the vaccine for more than two decades. He says it would be a big step for HIV research and can be licensed as a product if it passes all stages of testing. HIV has many uh, tricky or very sneaky way to protect it itself. So the developing a vaccine against HIV is not so easy. Sissy Insubica is a research technician in the lab. She says some of her family members are affected by HIV, making it meaningful work for her. To be a part of like the research makes me feel like I'm making a small difference in like a whole big picture. And hopefully in like 10, 20 years, I'll be able to say I helped out with that. Lou's HIV vaccine is known as a DNA vaccine. He says the technique uses DNA to create an immune response. We use the pieces of gene from the virus, but it itself is a health, uh, safe because it's not a whole virus genome. Uh, this cannot lead to viral infection. If it's successful, it would be the first of its kind. Lou says DNA vaccines could also be made for the flu and other viruses. It put the representing uh, the, the complete new era of vaccine uh, science. The testing is being done on healthy adults in four states, one being Massachusetts. Lou says they'll have their results in up to two years.